Hi, right, welcome back to the Hedvison Channel, and today we are looking at bin 10 Protector of Earth. So that is the uh, front cover in all its um, bin 10 glory. There we go, and then the side. Nothing special about it, and here is the back of the box. Yeah, nothing particularly special, that looks nice, nice artwork. The Omnitrix is in your control. Well, we'll see if it is in my control or not. Use the touch screen to transform into your favourite alien heroes. Okay, so there is the box. Here is a little the card which we need. And then let's have a look at the manual. See what kind of quality manual we have or do not have. Well, it's a bit of a sticker there, but never mind. So let's have a look. Okay, so it's uh, black and white, not particularly um, high quality, but I suppose it tells you what you need to know, and that's as good as it gets really on this sort of thing. The game screen, the main menu, pause menu, stage, select, we've got any stories about it? Um, not really, you've got multiplayer game, a new customer support, and the limited warranty. And that is that, so uh, there is no background story at all, which is a bit of a shame because we like our little stories. Ben can transform to different alien forms with a touch of the Omnitrix. Touch the outside ring of the Omnitrix to switch to the desired form. Touch the centre of the Omnitrix to change into that form. Okay, and there we go. So let's check it out on the first loading. So let's put it into our trusty DSIXL. And um, see if it's handheld heaven or handheld hell or somewhere in between. Here we go. Let's get the um, stylus out ready. And we're off. So let's start. The cartoon is work. Funky! So let's look at the, uh, so you got the options for the options menu. Just music and SFX. Um, okay, nothing spectacular there. Got the credits. I do like that in the background. That's, that's kind of, it's kind of nice. So uh, there's the credits. Look at that. Um, we're trying to get the start. Okay, so. We're going to play single player on the bin at 10. So. Well, we're going to start a new game. Who should we have? Let's have that. Oh, nice little map. And that's the Grand Canyon. Super. Okay, so let's go. Whoa! Good, you're awake. Something's crash landed over there in the canyon. Oh no, what could it possibly be? I'm hacking into the ranger station cameras to get a closer look. Leave this to professional. I'll just XIR be over there and check it out myself. It's hero time! Go, Mario Omnitrix Power! So. So you change. And at the moment we'll just stick to um, him. That's a nice, nice animation. Oh, let's get the alien form. And it's... Okay. So you've got the um, double arms, you've got the punch, you've got the um, throw rock thing, you've got the jump, that's the action burn, the rocks, there was some unlimited ox, and then we've got this punch, that's just all the punch, okay. Grand Canyon National Park, nice. Well so far it's pretty good, so let's change back to it's a cold world. Oh. 
Oh, don't forget. Okay, let's go. Oh. Hey, Dweeb. I know you can use bees to jump. Do not call me Dweeb. Oh, I do quite like this game. Yeah, I like the backgrounds. Okay. Oh, can I get in there? I'm going to do a long jump into there. Oh. I'm going to turn to bed. Make it jump further. Uh, no. Okay, I got a hint. Okay, so... What's that? Oh, let's kill some ass. We're doing pretty good so far. Not a bad. Um, we game miss it all. Let's see the end now. So I need to go, I'll probably go, go down. Uh, oh yeah, okay, let's go this way, let's go back to the Okay, we for my health, we'll get that. Okay. Okay, let's try a combo attack then. I'm not on the health. Oh, that was nice. Kick there, butts. This in green, get away from the starlight side. Oh, what's up there? Yeah, let's pick up the invisible rocks and hurry the people. Ooh, nice spin attack there. Okay. Does he now? How do I do exactly? Do I scale the wall and... You can only spend so long as the monster guy, and then it obviously times out so you can get back in again. Um, let's try that one. Oh, flame guy! Okay. That's nice. Oops, as it wasn't really what I wanted. Let's change again to. That's a real doll hunter. Let's change the fire guy. Uh. Burn, baby, burn. Wee. Nice. 
That was a burning tornado, twisty thing, and that didn't actually do much damage. Oh, let's get some combos going. Special moves. Got them. Right, okay, so I need to get up here. Come on. Okay, let's change back to one our time. Let the meter charge up. So I can change back into rock guy. Um, which is no, not that one. Okay, kind of got the uh, come on. Why won't you go up there? Struggling somewhat, which is not very good, I must say. Um, come on. Okay, I'm gonna have to um, just check the manual because I'm being a bit dim. Let's just pause this a moment. Look, I think it's a piece of the Omnitrix. Let's hope so, eh? So... I knew there was some reason my watch wasn't working. Oh, I can pick my nose so fast you can't even see it. My daughter blood actually. Oh, got my level. Can get some more guys. Okay, can I buy it? How many points have I got? 190. Okay, I can buy that. And then that'll do. I've just done this. That what? Hey, what's going on? I think it. Okay, um, something strange is. What, did I not miss the RV or something? That can't be right. No, let me just check and uh, see if I should have moved the RV. Okay, so I sorted that out, so there was a map you have to go to to get to the second level, so this is part of the second level. And, um, it's one out of time, so I need to transform back into that in a moment. Nice change of graphics here. Okay. Oh, and it said hold A to extinguish fires. Well, that's what I kind of did. Okay, good animation. Um, come on, get some special moves going. Seems to be struggling somewhat. Okay, that's that sorted. Okay, now then. You know, oh, no, wrong, wrong time to say that, wasn't it? Come on, little timer, let's kill these.
and failed. It says, let's try it again. Hold A to extinguish fires with heat blast. Okay, let's try that. Um, nonsense. Well, I'm back up here again. Oh, it stumped me, silly bloody game. Maybe we should try and check. Can I try and check somebody else? Fireman. Okay. Try using XR visuals here. Ok, we're trying to get to a different level. So here's a map. The bomb is going, so that's what we've done the um... The Grand Canyon, as we scored 1180. We've scored across here. And we've done the Mesa Verde. That one's been done as well, so the next one is Area 51. That's how the map works. It's quite a big map, lots of areas to visit. All these here. Eventually become a lot to go and visit those. It's a bit it doesn't scroll very well. What's like with this? Yeah, it's alright. Yes, yeah, so there's quite a lot to do. So that was level one. That was level two. And now this is level three. So we can upgrade our men. So we've got 425 points. We can get some four arms. Um, so here's what we want. Yeah, Tombstone Slam, that sounds kind of cool. That'll do. Let's purchase that. And then we'll go to um, Area 51. See what this level's like. Obviously, in this game, you're going to try and get as far as you can, and obviously, different um, metamorphoses get you to different things. So, the big rock man, I'll show you in a moment, it says I've um, dispatched these unruly people. Okay, let's get the timing up. So the um, you change you change your sorts of ones. You got the fireman, and you've got the sort of lizard guy who goes really fast, and you've got the rock. Well, I call him rock man. The big muscly man with two arms. He can climb stuff, and he's got a jumping and throwing stuff. So if you need to climb up vines and things, here's your man.
I need to get a fireman now. Just our time. Let's just wait for the timer to go up. Which is the top left there, that's a timer. When that's full, you can change your uh, appearance. We don't want him, we want the fireman so we don't get the burns. And go straight through there. Let's just see what's in there. Bit of health. Oh, that's just a, is that sort of boss guy? Oh, I think it's a bigger. Oh, it's a cool body. No, I could buy those. Get some goodies, but I can't. Yeah. I do like the animation. It's um, it's a pretty polished game. You know, for uh, entertainment. Medium, like TV medium, to be transferred into a game. They've done a pretty good job. I do think it's not bad. Um, it's got a good challenge to it. I want you to learn the moves. It's quite, it's quite good. So I think. I need to change to the uh, climbing man now. So the time I catch up to us and put the rock man on. He does a double jump. Just gonna go there. Oh, I thought I'd just try to get across there then. I have to come back, I must have missed. Unless it, unless it is that way, is it that way? No, it's not that way. So... Oh, well, okay. Just being a bit simple, uh, Mr. Platform. No, we're running out of time. Quick, run away. Oh, no, come on. That's a big man with a big hammer again. Die, 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 blue hammer man. Yes, got him. Okay, they're not bad. Let's put them there. The problem is sometimes it's, it's a bit of a pain doing this stuff here. You can't quite work out which man to use. Maybe it's um, this one with his... There we go. That's the only problem. I don't like this. This guy... So which is really fast, but sometimes you go up or across or down, you can't tell if it's going to work or not, and you can end up dying, which is a little bit annoying. And so like that, it's like... So yeah, not a particularly hard game. Well, I mean, on level three, and I don't think it's hard. And it's, it's quite nice. Overall, I would say this game is probably 
a good 7 out of 10. Just quite varied. It's nice to learn the different characters' moves and what they do to have a get out of that situation. And it's certainly a, um, a good, a solid DS game. It's not handheld heaven, um, and it's certainly not handheld hell, but it's handheld, have a good time. You know, five, five quid, five dollars, ten dollars maybe. You know, you've got a few hours of entertainment here. It's a nice package, just really well done. Um, oh, this is actually um, kind of tough. Oh, so we can beat this bit and then we'll call it a day. This is probably the end of the level. Come on, get up! I just did it in a matter of time. Yay! And is that at the end of the level? No, not quite. Let's just uh, get the dispatch these little critters. I do favour the big two arm man for fighting. We'll do one with him all the time. It just seems um, easy to fight with. Come to this level and then we'll turn it off. That didn't do a lot, did it? Obviously impervious to uh, fire tornadoes. And he's gonna run out of time. Cow in the corner. Can you squish the rugby old mighty hammer? No! Come on, let's change the big man. That's got to be it. No? Oh my god. Nice. This is a bit tough. Is it? No, I'm not. Oi, let me be. Oh my God! Come on. Got him.
He's a bloody pain in the arse with his big sword. That's got to be it. There we go. And the new area's opened up now. So yeah, on the whole, good game, recommended, 7 out of 10. Thanks for watching, until next time, bye.